I was like, okay, I'm gonna be playing a game here. And hey everybody, it's just me 99. Um, welcome to a new Let's Play series. I got this freaking phone camera uploader majigger thing working. We're going to be doing a little, like, you know, my, something mostly, I don't know, not mostly fun. Um, we're, that we're playing this. Uh, yeah, I, like, got it days ago on launch day, and, like, this was originally intended to, see, look, there's, my light's getting a horrible glare. Like, this originally was, like, intended to be, like, a, a blind let's play, um, man, that music, um, like, but, the whole video, kind of process that there with this, like, camera I was using wasn't exactly working out too well. I figured, hey, this thing's working again, we're gonna use it. You know, I don't know how good the screen is here, it looks pretty focused on here. And if you didn't know, this is like the music that came from the f like first trailer of the Shona, shown off E3, like, 2010, I think. Something. After about two years of waiting, we're finally playing this game. Foul I Like, I've played this up to like, World 2. So that pretty much kind of what to do. <clears throat> Today's story begins with one evening during a holiday called Sticker Fest. Sticker Fest is a celebration of stickers that occurs every year in the Mushroom Kingdom. On this special night, a sticker comet falls from far beyond the sky. If everyone concentrates and wishes on that on the sticker comet. They say that those wishes will come true. Like, and for the basic plot of this game, it's summed up very vaguely in this cutscene. And there's a good old Bowser. I love how, like, I like how they did that front view, right? And I hate how they redesigned the Koopas. I love their old design, the Bowser Norman, stuff like that. Why'd they have to change it this game? And it's over. And actually, the Toads are doing something, actually. No shiny for Bowser, I guess. Quick note, I gotta say, this is probably one of the best looking games in the 3DS. Yes. And... What is here? What is there? Crown Storm Bowser? He's basically going nuts. And it's some super ultra demon sticker shiny overlord thing. Apparently, like, it's somewhat very vaguely here, but apparently, this newfound power he prints into the power. This newfound power he is apparently using this to an advantage as a chance to kidnap Princess Peach. They really don't tell you, like, said there, but the, not the dialogue there, sorry. They got. Come on. Wake up! Yeah, press the A button to actually unfold yourself here. It's a him! Hey, you. Come over here a minute. Yeah, let's sign this here. Well, you came up right over here, huh? Good instincts, I like it. In case it's not obvious, I'm stuck here and I can't move. Hurry up and peel me off this thing. Just get close and hold on the A button. You can handle that, right? Now, peel! <sighs> that was unpleasant. Hey, wait a minute, you... What's your deal? 
You, you're the one who touched the comet. What's wrong with you? The same from the beginning of time, never ever touched the comet. The most are harder a million times. You don't think a comet packed with people's wishes might be the teens he bit dangerous? No, you know your infinite wisdom had to lay really little hands on, on it and go blammo. Total chaos. You even realize it blew off of those, blew off of the last, those royal stickers. Yeah, those royal stickers. No, it's not your fault, pal. You're taking full responsibility for this. Huh? Huh? Someone named Bowser such a sticker comet? You're a Mario? How dare you? Blame, putting the blame on someone else. Talk about Carl. You talk about completely unpaper like. That lady is in serious trouble here. Ask yourself, who the famous Mario at this time? Hmm. I love that Mario has to think that he's actually Mario. Huh? Really? That really help? Thanks. In that case, I'll introduce myself. I'm Kirsty. If you didn't know, it's like sticker back, like scrumbled up sticker. She's a little bit your clothing of to be in this game. I came, I came from the far away sticker store to grant everyone's wishes to the sticker fest. It's not me buying some on you, so it's the stickers who wield those mystical powers to grant those wishes are known as royal stickers. Now they're scattered all over. It's their caretakers, my duty to find all of them, or else they can't return to the sticker star. So yeah, that's that's why you have to help me find the royal stickers. Looks like they fell outside of town, so first we need to find a way to get out of here. Like, she's the equivalent of, like, the Goombario, Goombella, and the, and the, the Tippy from the other pre previous Paper Mario games. Mario, I was just pasting this all over the place. Really, have you just got the thing for press like this? Here, take it. I, I should play it. I remember I should, like, be giving characters voices. If I'm at the voice... The phone. If I'm gonna the voice, so it's gonna be annoying. It may not look like much, but that hammer's got flaw in this thing, which is rigidity that echoes back to the kid of <coughs> history. Yeah. If you just press B, you'll master it in no time. Sorry for destroying your ears, viewers. Okay, so obviously you can jump. Now that you, s now you can use that awesome thing. Life is good, huh? Break stuff, knock some stuff down, just whack whatever you want. Yeah, <sighs> so I'm not talking too much during this video. Um, great, that was fun, yeah. Pissed behind the sign from the Forgotten Corner. The number that I draw in the, in the to Rescue Toad Lottery is two. Story of my life. Talk about being flat out unimportant. They do have, like, I do like how in this. Yeah, it's like not exactly too much paper likes like the first one and the uh as we were kind of but it does make a lot of puns and look lot looks a lot like a diorama. Hey. Huh? Hey, that's a sticker, isn't it? Look lucky you picking up something that great. Well you can't just stand something as important as a sticker in your pocket. So let me give you an album to keep that in. Basically stickers you're gonna have to rely on these for battle moves. Not bad, huh? Any sticker you find, you just pop it in the album. Trust me, you're gonna need as many of those as you can. So, for, you're gonna need as many of those as you can find later on. So take good care of them. Like, you don't, you have, you don't select a move, like, costing you any, like, flower points, or anything like that, you don't have any badges or any experience points. So really, just pretty much no gain from fighting enemies. Like, the only gain from it is, like, you earn more coins at the end of the level. Yeah. I figured, like, it would be a good time to, like, review a new game. Maybe, I know there's gonna be a lot of people, like, searching up Let's Plays and stuff for this here. So, I thought that would be pretty good, like, might to get a little bit more viewers with this here. And say, don't know that high is really kind of terrifying. I'm just gonna tough. Um... What he said about laundry. And I know this is probably a good way to make up for me, like canceling my Super Paper Mario Let's Play and just kind of like going silent for about like a like a year or so. I uh, was kind of hoping you'd be a little gentle with the whole peeling process, you know, a little delicacy. I mean, I'm, not, I'm not ripped anywhere, am I? No. No. Thanks for your help. In case you can't tell, I'm trying to like add a little depth to characters. Like I, sh I should be doing the voices. And I'm 
probably going to be ending the episode off here. And, uh, yeah, I'll continue off next time.